Greetings, I am Cross Knights, and this is Zombie Smashing Adams. Close. It looks like I'm doing pretty good here, right? Looks like I, I'm doing great, until you realize that I'm behind by like 5,000 victory points. But, hey, I'm not out of the game yet. And anyone who says differently will get hit by a 2x4 shot out of a rhinoceros's horn. What? I stand by the statement, despite not knowing what I just said. So I just upgraded artillery again, and it's gonna shoot, like, a bajillion shells now, I think. Six? Okay. Six bajillion. They're both, uh, multiples of two. We'll go here. Since I have artillery, I should be able to clear this place out. And then hopefully I can start working on gaining back some victory points, because damn, do I ever need victory points. What I don't need is barricades. Barricades are dumb. Barricades are for people who hate sidewalks, and I am a fan of the sidewalk. You know there are some places that don't have sidewalks, and then it's like nighttime, and you have to walk, and the cars get really close to you, and it's freaky, and then the big trucks honk at you, and you're like, ah, I'm just walking, not everyone can afford to have a car at certain points in their life. It happens. I'm just saying. Sidewalks are good. You die, you die, you die, and you die. Please? I said please. And alright. I'm glad they accepted my offer of them dying. Fire, 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 fuck fire. I'll have you go up here to finish off the strays. Artillery is so ridiculous. <laughs> They let you get it, like, it gets so powerful, it's crazy. I mean, it pretty much becomes the elephant bird later on. I mean, not quite, but almost. It's practically the elephant bird now. So there's three more, four more zombies left. Um, oh, wrong button. You? Oops. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Infantry, go up. Actually, I should have had the uh, the artillery take care of this one and the infantry get that one, because I can't hit that one. Because it's too damn close to the gun. Somebody kill that damn zombie! It's gonna cause me to fail the state. Ah, oh, beautiful. Well, that was just all types of sad. I was, like, so jazzed and stuff, and then that crap had to happen. Oh well. <laughs> That's what happens. One zombie sneaks up in front of that gun and you can't do anything. I should almost just cut this part out and be like, I won! But no. Nope. Can't do that. Um, no, you guys stay the hell away from my gun. You stay away and become good little chunks of corpses like you're destined to. Artillery barrage. Coolio. And there's one on top. I'm not gonna get this round, but someone will get him. Yep, he is the only one left. The sole survivor. I'll dodge this and this and this and this. You get the hell out of there. You're gonna blow up. Gotcha. At this point, if they give me the artillery, I win. I win hard. Even though, alright, so I'm 4,600 points behind. Okay. But I do have a lot of the, uh, the territory, so... And currently I have more territory than the zombies, so that's always nice. A bap. I can start to catch up. Increased heliscopter. Increased heliscopter speed. The th reason that I got so screwed is because there's a huge cl cl um, cluster of territories. And instead of, like, knocking a few of those out, I ignored it, and... Trouble happened. <laughs> if I had been paying more attention, I never would have put in, put in such dire straits. But then this video probably wouldn't have been that interesting, because I would have just won. I would have just hit the win button. Yeah. 
But, like, the problem is that, like, towards the end of the game, I felt that um, extended campaigns got a lot less interesting. Especially when you had artillery, it was just, it was just like, over most of the time. It was just game freaking over. So, that's why I wasn't going to do it initially. But we'll see. We'll see how people react to it. No more mines available. Oh, I see. How about artillery? Here, just in case they get past, because I'm going to put my helicopter right to here. All right. I do have my bait, but let's uh, time the dynamite correctly. Dynamite tool. And I killed both of the big zombies. That's good. Um, bait. Please stay away from my citizens. As I smite you. Smite you all. Where my cat bird at? There we are. Um, here. Oh, I just gotta keep him away. No, 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 no. Is it? No, 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 no. Oh, the zombie started running away. That was weird. <laughs> okay. Not questioning it. Oh, God, they're going to turn a whole bunch of people. I don't think I can stop it in time either. No, got to stay by the helipad. Too bad I'm not going to be able to capture the territory, but whatever. It happens. Death happens. That's so not what I wanted to do. I'm, like, fumbling all over here. Move over. Smite the interlopers. Catbird. Oh, I could just catbird all those guys, but since my infantry's already over there, I'll hit these guys. And it is nighttime. I was not able to save everyone. Oh, good. Come on. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. There. Stay by the helicopter. Guys, stop. Oh. See, those guys to the south are just wandering off like idiots, and now they're gonna die. It's their own damn fault. Little to no sympathy. Um, ooh. This is a nice cluster right here. Bam! Look at all those. If only I had a high explosives to take care of them. But no. Alas. It is not to be. You, sir, an idiot, and you deserve to die. I said it. Your life was worthless. So, th almost 400 victory points and a lot of leveling up. So that's good. Um, leveling up speed so they can move faster. The infantry. Now can use five landmines. And once again, doing range. Always doing range. Alright. Not bad. That should do a decent job of me catching up. Hoorah! Alright. Be trailing by 4,000. Reduced helicopter speed. If they give me artillery, I'm... Yep, they're giving me artillery. Time to do a level 4 mission. Let's see what you guys got for me. Give me, um, I mean, mercenary experiments. experience is almost not worth it at this point, so give me the artillery mod to max. And elephant bird just for fun, just in case I get one of those 30 second days. I'll be able to finish it off of the enhanced elephant bird. Okay, um, yeah, level 4. Which level 4? This level 4. This one has the bigger spread potential. So, winning gun! The gun made of pure, unadulterated winning. And boomsticks, boomsticks, boomsticks! And, uh, blowing up gas main sticks. Actually, no, screw that. We'll leave that to the landmines. Do some nice thinning out with those. So a landmine here. And a landmine here. And one here. And here. And 
Gandalf's a friggin' here. I don't even know where I'm gonna shoot the artillery first. There's freaking explosives everywhere. Um, yep, yep. This could still be a bit rough just because, um... Like, the, the zombies might dodge out of the way, but it shouldn't be too hard since they're not, uh, super speedy zombies or anything. There's the gas man. Let's get the dynamite. Kill some of the trailing guys. Uh, catbird. Where are you, catbird? There you are. And group everyone together. Carpet bomb these guys. Here comes the pain. The pain rain. The rain for the pain falls mainly on your crane. Yep. There's one zombie over there, but I have like 30 seconds to kill it, so if I can just kill this cluster, we're good. And even if I can't just kill all this cluster, I'm probably still good. And death, 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 death. Watch me still miss because it wanders off. Nope, he's staying around the explosions. Like a good fading zombie. Yeah, you done been blown up to many pieces. Wow, to get that dynamite up, I need to kill a whole bunch of... Oh, and the artillery, too. The artillery's almost maxed, though. The artillery's quite powerful enough as it already is. I'm not all that worried if I can't get that up to the next level. But as you can see, I own most of the map. Oh, hum. Alright. How many points for trailing by now? Uh, still like 4,000. I'm not getting enough of a jump here. But that will change, maybe. If I can do a level 3. And, of course, the only level 3 turret. No, there's another level 3. Excellent. What do I have? I have artillery. That always helps. And barricade. That's great for rescue missions. Let's increase the helicopter capacity to, um, 45. And go to the only level 3 territory in the hopes of striking it big. Oh, the territory's so big, it's overwhelming. Nah. We'll be fine. Let's go in super corral mode. Well, first, let's go and stick you in a place that you'll never have to deal with anyone mode. Then we'll go to, uh, barricade here. And here. Here. I swear, I gotta, I gotta click like two or three times sometimes when I'm recording. Now, I think there's an alleyway there. So I should be able to block off this entire thing. Yep. <laughs> These zombies can only get to the main places by going up here. Which sucks for them. And, uh... There, that'll block off those top ones pretty nicely. And let's shoot this direction. Um, shoot these guys first if you see them. And dynamites. And the helicopter shall go right smack a dab here. Even though there's a bunch of scientists over there, but I'm not really strapped for scientists at this moment. Um. Whoops. <laughs> Didn't mean to shoot that off already. Oh, well, maybe it'll be okay. Maybe I can make it up with artillery. Destroy them all! That catbird. Bam! Just like I blew a hole through, uh, past one of my barricades, so whatever. It's taken care of. It's taken care of. And bam. Please kill them. Oh god, please kill them. All of them. Yes! Catbird again! Damn! Holy crap, that killed a lot of people. <laughs> Oh dear. Um, yep. See how that goes. If you get, if you kill all the zombies on a level three stage, you get tons of victory points, pretty much guaranteed. Catbird again, man. This thing is practically an elephant bird. Let's see if I can kill that individual zombie here and here, here. Sniper. Tonight? Okay, cool. Got it. How many points are you giving me? You're giving me 630 points. That should help. That should help loads. That was with a Z. I saw that loads. 
Excellent. Now only trailing by uh, 3,200. I think I'm still outpacing them on the uh, the map territory add up, but I might just be about breaking even. No, I think I'm outpacing them. That's a fair amount of points they're getting, though. Oh, uh, yeah, 3,100. Elephant bird! Free conquering of a level 4 territory is what that is. And two more level 3s for me, that's too bad. Let's go here. I wonder what happens if I use an elephant bird on a level 3 territory. Does craziness happen? Will it let me? Let's see what happens. I've never tried it before. Interesting! This might be bloody. <laughs> I guess we'll see what happens. Oh dear. I've always done a level 4 territory when I've had the elephant bird. Yeah, let's see what happens. It's gonna be crazy. I'm glad I leveled it up, I'll tell you that much. Bam. 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 Uh, bam. That takes care of most of the bottom ones, most of the top ones. Basically just want to stop them from getting to the people. Well, uh, trying to blow up as many, as little, as, as few of the people as possible, not as many. <laughs> blow up zombies, not people. Blow up zombies, not people. Are you kidding me? Kill them! Kill them! Kill them in the face! They're the only ones left. Ugh. Where's... Oh, God. How the hell did you get past me? Um, three? Three. Three! Alright. There we go. Almost 800 victory points. I like it. Oh, and the, and the helicopter even leveled up. Let's put you to, uh, point nine. Because that's cool. Wham! <laughs> All right. Yep, it's this, it's this end game part that made me think I shouldn't do an extended campaign, because this is generally how it goes. You either, um, start kicking ass towards the end, or you lose. As far as I know, there's no in-between. So, 2,300 points. Are you kidding me? What the hell are the chances of that crap? I actually got Elephant Bird twice in a row. Um, I guess I'm doing a level 4, because you jerks are forcing my hand. You hand forcey jerks. Should have leveled it up again. If you level it, the uh, cat bird up again, then you can actually fire it 12 times before reloading. <laughs> But the thing about this thing is that it reloads so fast that it almost doesn't matter. Like, look at it. And reloaded. Yep. That's what that's about. Catbird. So there's two zombies here. Pack here. Zombies up there. Drop bombs on him! Bombs! There we are. <laughs> Could not get any easier. If I was a gigantic robot that went at max speed and ate zombies. Woohoo! Another territory. Now, there are actually two ways to win the game. Um, the game will actually stop if there's no more viable territories. And as you can see by the victory points, I'm probably not going to get all the way to the end before all the territories are taken up. Unless I can do level 3 territories, which I really want to do. But they're not letting me. And that's why I did the uh, whole, uh, you can purchase llama bombs. Are you... Am I being watched over by God? You're actually giving me llama bombs right when I was about to purchase it for the second time in a row? That's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. Not complaining, however. Uh, I can wipe out all but one said territory. <laughs> yep, we've gotten to the part of the game where I'm pretty much just picking on the poor downtrodden zombies. Let's get the Kraken Bomb to really put the hurt on gigantic zombies. Um, let's get Catbird. 
And let's do the only zombie territory that's left of this one. And they gave me artillery again. At this point, though, as long as they gave me... Oh, they gave me, they gave me like, the best... <laughs> the best zombie-killing mercenaries available. The low, low price of they better damn well work, or else the world will be destroyed. Let's see. There we go. I'll cover those. Ish. Let's corral them so that they have to keep on going down. No. <laughs> Didn't have quite enough to finish that, did I? Whatever, I'm leaving it. I don't even care. It's not like I need them. And here we go. Maybe I shouldn't have put the artillery next to gas main, but whatever. And there we are. Destroy them all! But don't hit that gas main. Oh god, do not hit that gas main. Uh, again. Positioning sniper. One cat bird. Um, Given the infantry a break, pretty much, because I don't really need to move them at this point. That's right. I'll show you what our bloated military budget can do. We're just chucking dynamite like it's candy. Not even the good candy, cheap candy. We are rich and powerful. Eh, let's do this, whatever. Artillery is maxed, I can now fire it five times without reloading. Because that's how I roll. Maximum carnage and maximum destruction. Oh look, the zombies don't get any territory points. What fools! <laughs> They didn't expect me to use exploding llamas. They never expect exploding llamas. No oh, jeez. I was really hoping for a level three, guys, but whatever. I'll just accept dominating your pants off. Um. Bam? Does it even matter at this point? Maximum level of catbird now charges 30% uh, faster than it did initially. What do I have? Um, I don't have... I don't have artillery, so I'm going to do uh, a nice, leisurely, level 2 zombie apocalypse invasion. It's never leisurely. Never. Cool. And the helicopter will go here. Try to get those scientists. And again, it's not like the scientists really matter that much at this point, but I'm doing it anyway. Aiming here. Alright, and I have zombie bait in case some of them start to really get out of hand. Which I don't think will happen. Alright, now what? The scientists are the blue dots. Watch how fast they run when they hear the bullhorn. Whee! Two or three times faster than normal people. And bam. No. Oh. They're not even getting to my other landmine because, uh. Oh god, that's so big. Because they're just being sniped before they even reach the landmine. Destroy! Oh, wait. Okay, good. I was worried I was gonna hit the gas man and I didn't really want to. Moving out. We have a whole minute to kill them all. That's probably enough, but I don't know. Maybe not. Because I think they're gonna reach... Well, there's only three people. They can't turn that many people into zombies. Yeah, I might be okay. I don't know, though. I'll go after them. But can I shake off the... Oh, good. That is just what I needed. No, that... This is just what... Whatever. Is that the elephant bird? I don't know. We'll find out. Yes, it is. Whoops! I just took a lot of lives. <laughs> I am sorry. The man is weeping. Uh, 30 seconds to kill them. <laughs> I can't believe how many people I just killed. And needlessly, really. It was just really bad aiming on my part. Pick off these four and we can all go home. Except for those 30 or so families that I demolished by accident. But 
I won't think about it. Let's just move on. Think about all the ones I've saved. Nearly 300 victory points, only trailing by 1,400. You guys all thought I was doomed, didn't you? Didn't you? Ha 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 ha! Or maybe not, I don't know. I've only uploaded the first one of the extended campaign so far. Hear it. Yeah. Alrighty then, shorter daytime. That could be an issue. You had to land in the same place twice, you jicks. What do I have? Artillery. Um, let's do a level one. Cause that shorter daytime could screw me. Oh, this is this is pathetic. Let's put the helicopter here to just try to haul these guys away from the explosions that are gonna happen right away. Alright. Yeah, you guys aren't going anywhere, I assure you. Ain't going anywhere. Like the second they get into the city, ow, okay, ow, ow, ow. Cool. Oh, I guess that was kind of leisurely, wasn't it? I think so. Now, if you, if all the cap, if all the territories are captured, I don't know if you automatically win or if you only win if you have more victory points. But it's pretty hard to get into a situation where you, uh, where there's no more territory to go and you're not winning victory points. Well, I'm sure it could happen. Only trailing by Nintendo 64 times 100 points. Let's say in the most confusing way possible, because that's how I roll. Is that a level 3? It is indeed. Let's do it. Yeah. This might be a longer than normal video, because I, I kind of want to finish it here, because there's no point in doing another part after this, considering how far I've gotten into it. All set up. Helicopter here. Let's go. Why the hell did that song bump in my head? There's no water or mustaches. Oh god. Blowing holes in my barricades. I do not approve. There. Yes. All gather around the delicious smelling whatever blue stuff. Um, Alright, so I've killed all the small zombies. I just haven't killed the big zombie because I don't have any explodies. Which is unfortunate. But, because of that, the large zombie will go through and just kill people instead of converting them. And that large zombie just blew up that entire pack, so that's nice. Um, I don't think I can get... Oh, wait. Yes. Destroy all the front ones. Up, up, up more. Up more. I need to destroy those ones. Uh, did they get past? Damn it. I sacrificed all those people for, like, nothing. No, not nothing, because that one's going upwards. Okay. Um, all of you go here. So I wasn't able to totally lock things up, but it looks like I've saved 104 people. That's going to be a lot of points regardless. And let's move you down. And the infantry is moving quite a bit faster. Looks like you guys are going to be a problem first. Shoot them in the neck, beards. Come on. Okay. Oh, we've, we've done about all we could. Ish. I could probably do more, actually. No. Yes. Excellent. Draw them! Draw a picture of them. And then cause them to die. Bam. All saved. 400 victory points. And eight scientists. And I'm still trailing by 200 points. 
But that's okay, because I got another territory. I own pretty much the whole map. And they get a piddling amount. I'm now ahead by 35 points. Helicopter speed increased. Yup, that's all there is now. Me wiping out territories. Should I even show it? I don't know, maybe I should just end the entire campaign. But I guess I'll continue showing it. Um, I should have paid attention to the mercenaries. This one might actually be a little bit tricky. Bam, bam, Bigelow. The big zombies always seem to come from up top, like without fail. I mean, maybe that's how it works. Maybe they always come from up top. Or maybe they have been coming from the bottom at times, and I just didn't notice. In any case, hopefully we'll be able to kill them all. Hard to say. What is it? Uh, oh, increased helicopter speed. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have done a level wipe wipe out uh, territory explosions when I actually had a helicopter boost. But a little bit late to worry about that now, isn't it? Group together. Uh, let's see if I can kill the second squad. How you doing, Shooty McShoot Face? All right, still hitting people. Good. That is what I am paying you for. My 90% accuracy, I'm, uh, infantry kills really efficiently, too. Pretty much never miss. Very 80% accuracy still. They still hardly ever miss. Four out of five ain't bad. Sniper, move down a little bit so that you can actually hit a few people. 20 seconds. We probably got this, but you never know. So these guys should have moved the infantry to the to the left or whatever. Um, is that good? Are they gonna? No, it's not. I gotta move it. One, two, woo! Down to the wire. Excellent. 100. We're ahead by 135 uh, points. But man, if I wasn't lucky with those llama bombs, <laughs> this would not have gone like this. So I actually, I, I actually did not need to do to click the uh, purchase llama bombs button. I never used it. Look how many scientists I have. This is just getting ridiculous. Um, let's have super... Well, let's have maximum capacity of helicopter. Wow, I can actually go up to 55. That's kind of cool. Um, mercenary training, I guess. I mean, people are still leveling up. Um, let's do this level 2 here. Run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm a scientist. Screw the barricades! I have something better than barricades. Evil glares. Zombies, like, cannot pass them. Bam, bam, bam. You see that? That was not dynamite, but evil glares. Of hope and wonder. Bam. You, you, you. And, of course, my captive audience. Off to the east. Or is that the west? That's the west, isn't it? Yeah, off to the west. But ever. Ah, they weren't so captive, were they? They're running off for greener pastures. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. No, don't do that. Don't do that. They just killed everyone. What jerks. You guys are jerks. And <laughs> I failed the stage! Because I had to go and cavalierly murder everyone, whether they be human or zombie. Because I'm crazy like that. Well, good thing I have my magical time stone. Time stone activate! It's Prince of Persia style, you say. Um, alright, let's just do better this time. That sounds like a plan. It generally works, unless you fail to do so. Dynamite. Concentrate my artillery 
you down here for now. Uh, shoot this up a little bit. This is much better. There is much less um, friendly fatality here. Except I'm going to use a cat bird just to kill that one zombie there. Whatever. Oh my god, get that last one. Are you kidding me? Good. <laughs> he almost snuck past me like a jerk. Wow, I need to save um, a lot of people to level that up. 1,200. Dynamite has leveled up. Dynamite is leveled up to level 3. I can now have 6 Dynamitesses. Dynamitesses. 410 points. Racing to the end here. I'm just mopping things up. So we're still uh, about 4,400 victory points away from victory. Level 4 Z outbreak. Well... Ugh, I was gonna purchase llama bombs because I didn't want to do a level four. I just didn't feel like it. I want to do rescue missions, man. Let me do rescue missions. I want to feel like a hero, and like one of those heroes that rescues people, not like the ones that uh fight legions of ninjas. Oh, well. I guess the regular type of hero is good too. And here, and on the exploding building, because that's always, always makes life more exciting. And they've given me the, uh, no, I did not mean to do that, but it doesn't matter. Probably only killed like three zombies with that dynamite. Just hoping these guys to decrease the spread a little bit. Cat bird. Not yet. I'll blow up my infantry. Just put it here. Still might blow up my infantry. Keep on moving. Infantry? Get infantry. Keep moving. Nope. Not there. It is. <laughs> Can't tell if I would have gotten the infantry there or not. But I did manage to blow up my gun. Not quite sure how. I was looking at a different sector of the map. Snipe him. And we can all go home and start the next stage. Dun dun. Hooray! Give me the entire map! This map is for humans. Not for you damn pinky purpley guys. You eat humans. Oh, I'm sorry, did you only get 120 points? <laughs> wow, I've been playing this game for uh, three years, apparently. Jeez. Shorter daytime, less zeds. Um, I'm going to buy llama bombs. Sorry. But I think it's obvious at this point that I don't need the llama bombs to win. I'm just trying to hurry things along here. All Z territory is destroyed. That means that I get, uh, th uh what is it, five free, free scientists, I think? And, of course, all of my territory points without zombies interfering with me. If I'm lucky, I can pull off another one, one or two rescue missions before I have to end things. Yep. Rescue! Only three stages left. Go! Artillery! Artillery! Artiller, tiller, tiller, artillery! Of course, uh, <laughs> the one place I decide not to put artillery is the place with the big zombie. That's just how the world works. Um, there it is. No, there it is. Hit! Explosion laser face. And infantry is taking care of all theirs. That bird will pick up the slack. 
Yep, artillery makes things ridiculous. Ridiculous! Everyone saved. Well, not everyone. Seems like I managed to blow up half the people that lived here, but still. At least they're not zombies. How close are we getting there? Fill my cup up with delicious victory points. Yeah, I'm getting ridiculous with large amounts of points each round. I'm ahead by 3,700 points. What are you going to give me? Level 4 is that egg break? Good luck finding space. They gave me artillery. It's time to end this. Let's end this debacle. Uh, let's put you right smack dab in the middle-ish. Kind of exactly center. Ignoring barricades. They're a waste of my time. They're like pennies. It's not even worth picking up at this point. On a side note, pennies are horrible and need to be get ri getting rid of. I think they cost like uh, 1.8 pennies to make. That's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. And there's no reason not to get rid of the damn things. We got rid of the hay penny back in like the 1800s. You know what happened? Nothing. Also, the hay penny was worth what a dime is now. Alright, enough about my irrational hate of pennies. I can't even use them on the bus, damn it! Alright, enough. It's neither here nor there. The only machine that takes them in America is freaking Coinstar! And they just steal my damn 10% of my money in Red Come down, Cross. I just hope that I live to see the end of the penny in my life, Dad. Oh, 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 and, and, and not quite. I am, um, 1,200 away from stuff. Shorter daytimes, less zeds. Let's see if I can do this. Did they give me artillery? They did not. Uh, <laughs> Shorter daytime is usually, like, almost no matter what. Well, unless you have, like, crazy artillery. Very hard to do these stages with only 30 seconds. In most cases, it's impossible, in fact. Well, we'll see what happens. Probably just gonna concede and then auto win. And the fact that I need to kill those big zombies does not help at all. Uh, screw you. Oh, I'm not even shooting him. I mean, it was it was shorter day, less Zeds, that helps, but not without an explosion. I mean, I, if I could set these off, that'd be fine, but I can't. And I'm not going to be able to do enough damage to get the Catbird Cannon, so... Gonna need to concede again, it looks like. Level 4 stages are so damn treacherous, I'm telling you. Anti-climax. Now, do I win? Hopefully not. It would be good to wipe out that last stage, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? Uh... Oh no, we still got... I could probably go another round without winning, actually. Shorter dame time. You guys hate me, don't you? Did you give me artillery? They didn't. Because <laughs> they literally hate me. And they want to draw this out. Ooh, but they did give me infantry. No, that's not that's not better. It's not better at all. I almost want to just auto concede here. Yeah. Terrible combination of mercenaries makes it unable for me to complete this. Bam. That's not gonna activate ever, is it? Too bad. Doing it. And let's funnel you all to my infantry. Now that it's gonna matter. Because it's not. It's not gonna matter. And yeah. Actually, that was just shorter daytime. That didn't say shorter daytime, less Zeds. I have vastly less chance of doing this. Even though I'll be able to use my catbird this time. 
Oh, good. Set off the landmine. All right, don't set off the landmine yet. I'm going to sneak around here. I'm going to sneak around and everything will be fine. Everything's not going to be fine. Um, he's dead. As if it mattered. <laughs> that combination of mercenaries combined with the only one with the, uh, the time limit, no way in hell. No, that's not what I wanted. I wanted conceding. I wanted turning tail and running. Come on, don't win. Don't win, it'll be too anticlimactic. Uh, 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 and I've won! Well, that's a shame. Oh, well, <laughs> I'm sorry for the anticlimax, but that's just the way the dice rolls. We annually spend on military security... I don't think I'm... Yeah, I mean, I already showed the ending. I'll just go through it faster here. We recognize the imperative need for this development. Yet we must not fail to comprehend its grave implications. In the councils of government, we must guard against the acquisition of unwarranted influence, whether sought or unsought, by the military-industrial complex. The potential for the disastrous rise of misplaced power exists and will persist. We must never let the weight of this combination endanger our liberties or democratic... I mean, the ending makes more... more like, kind of makes sense if you read the vignettes. But there's still just so much I don't get what the hell is going on. Um, that is the true ending of Atom Zombie Smasher. Now at some point I'm going to be LPing Limbo, but I don't know when. The problem is that I want to do that game blind, but it auto-saves. Meaning I'm probably going to screw up a recording and it's going to ruin everything, so I've been delaying it. But um, yeah, hopefully I'll see you in one of my other LPs. Later.